parents, they uh, went here, my uncle went here, so it's a big rivalry and it's a game I definitely want to win. Yeah. Yeah, no, absolutely, especially um, what's at stake too, and that's the Territorial Cup. And so to bring that home to Tucson will pretty much be my uh, bowl game for me. Do you think everyone understands on the team? Do you think everyone gets it yeah. as much as you do? Especially the new guys, I feel like it's going to be their first experience, and I think it's going to be a shock <laughs> for them. But um, And they're going to definitely feel the rivalry once they get to Tempe and in that stadium for game time. So. I, I know everything that gets said maybe you can't say on camera, but what's, <laughs> what's that first moment that you said, okay, this is different, uh, this is not typical type of rivalry or even game? Oh, yeah. I mean, uh, it was like two years ago we were at ASU and we were coming out of the tunnel and you already see them looking at you and they're saying some things. Uh, that, um, yeah, no, and I was like, okay, this is it right here. So it, it's good. I love it. How does that maybe change even your level of intensity when you start to hear things like, okay, this is how it's going to be. Now I have to kind of raise my own level of oh, intensity. Uh, oh, yeah. No, you definitely have to raise your intensity when you play those guys, especially in their home turf and against their fans who are not going to be nonstop. Um, so, and then just to beat them there and silence them there would be amazing. I was on my visit when that happened, so I was I was kind of ready for this game. You know, like I'm... I'm a high intense guy, so like whenever it's action like that, I'm always ready for it. And everybody's been talking about it or whatever, but I mean, I feel like we're ready. Yeah, it was me, Miles, and Trey was here, and uh, you know when we saw that, it was like, yeah, this is a, this is an intense rivalry. Like they ain't really go at it. But I don't know. I haven't been to like a rivalry like that game in a long time, so that kind of like. Boosted my visit a little bit. How much are you just looking forward to being a part of this year's and, and getting a feel for what that's like to you know be suited up for a game like that? <laughs> I'm ready for it. I'm excited. Really excited. Oh man, you know, it, I didn't really understand it when I uh, when I got here. I knew it was gonna be a big rivalry, but you know, I didn't realize how you know deep that rivalry is, how historic it is, and just the energy last year was unbelievable. So you know, I can't wait to plan it. Um, they just said, you know, it's just a, an emotionally charged atmosphere. So, um, you, you obviously, it's going to be loud there. Um, but uh, they said there's nothing like it. So I'm really excited. So your, what was your uh, reaction when you found out that Coach Yona had been let go? Uh, it hurt me. I ain't going to lie to you. Yeah, it hurt. Because I see, I see myself. I, I never really have a fall. I never had a father. So. Um, I looked at my coaches as like a father figure, so that really hurt. And I was close to Yona, huh. Coach Yona. Did Coach Sumlin talk to you about that, or did some yeah. one of the other? Yeah, he talked to me, but I mean, did you or did you go to him and express those sort of feelings to him? Or? No, he talked to me, but huh. it is what it is. Hmm. I've heard uh, some of the other guys when when the other coaching changes happen say that you know we, it's a business. Yeah. And you kind of learn that the hard way sometimes. Did you kind of feel like you maybe learned that lesson? Yeah, I did. A little bit. I didn't know what it was because JUCO that don't that don't happen like that, you know. But I learned it when that happened, and Coach Aids happened. I learned that. Mm -hmm. uh, I was pretty shocked when I heard the news. Uh, I got two years with Yona, and uh, he came up to me my senior year. And he said, "I want to help you. It'd be great. Be the best football player you can mm -hmm. this year." And I said, I'm, I'm ready, let's go, let's do it. And he was a great teacher. Uh, and he really helped me understand the game a lot better. Uh, I would say it was tough because he was a good guy. We all liked him, but it's part of the business. And we have to move on and continue playing hard.